Good morning, Ani. Good morning. How are you doing this morning? I'm great, thank you. What kind of workouts are we doing today? We're doing metabolic, strength training, all kinds of stuff. And body weights. Workout, and body yes. weights. Okay. So we're going to warm up. You're going to show us what, what you do to warm up? Yes. Which is not what the average person does to warm up, right? A couple push ups. A couple push ups. Push -ups. Oh, oh, a couple one arm push ups. You warm up with one arm push ups? Yes. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> Just warm up a little bit. Okay, that's the warm up. This is a lot of people's workout. <laughs> You guys notice first of all i want everybody to pay attention right now these are not the crossfit kip up pull-ups she's actually extended all the way down at the bottom keeping her torso straight and using her back muscles to pull herself up and she's not even using any grips either which takes a strong grip all right that, that's warm up and a couple balance workout the chest and back at the same time all right so you do stuff with balances a lot of core stuff in here I'm so bad at core stuff. Right. So it's a one arm row with a one arm cable crossover on a Bosu ball. Alright, so what attachment are you putting on? It's the handle, double handle. Alright. What is that, 150? Something Five. like that. 5,000? <laughs> 500? I do this workout on Friday. The end of the week. It's like a full body workout? Full body workout. It's a plyo with a row on a bosu ball. My favorite part is watching her build these things. It's like a big, like Lego set. <laughs> it's a big adult Lego set. So now it's a lunge with a bicep curl on a Bosu ball with a pistol squat added. I could be doing all this right now, but I'm just gonna go ahead and let her <laughs> Demonstrated. A lunge with a bicep. Then when you do the, like do the opposite side too, right? You just switch it out. How many reps do you do on each side? Usually I do between twenty and twenty-five. Twenty-five reps on each side. Yes, I don't do those workout. During the week, when I separate my body, only chest, only back, shoulders, then I go heavy. Mm -hmm. The end of the week, the so you full do, body. You do like one body part a day, and then you do a full body at the end of the week. Yes. It's so like five days in the gym training weights? Or? Four to five days. Four to five days. Which is not a lot. Some people would you know, think you'd no probably be in the gym every day. No 45 to 50 minutes. In and out. Right, sit again. 45 to 50 minutes. So less than an hour. Uh, so all the hour. people that say stuff like, you must be in the gym all day long. No. 45 minutes and out. 45 minutes or an hour. Deal. Quick in and out. Quick in and out. That's right. Get in, get out, and get growing and recovering, right? Yes. Yeah. All right, so now we're going to do a lateral raise. If you look at the dumbbells compared to how big she is, they're pretty big dumbbells for her size. Those are 25s? 50, half of my weight. Half of your weight. So those are 25 pound dumbbell laterals, which a lot of guys I know nowadays that actually weigh a lot more than you, that's the weight that they use. But what are you, you're going to stick a foot on a BOSU ball too, so it makes it 10 times as hard. I would never do these because I'd fall off and hurt myself. You guys can see very clearly that her delts are pulling those weights up. Now there's a little bit of momentum, but you have to do that with the BOSU ball to try to keep your balance. So you see, she's controlling those things pretty damn good for her size. Half her weight in dumbbell laterals. Jeez. So, 
<laughs> is that all? <laughs> so you, how many times you run through that stuff? Like you do how many? You do the circuit or you do individual? I do a circle. The circuit. So how many circuits? I do uh, usually two to three maximum. And that'll take like 45 minutes? 45 minutes. And then when you're done with that, do you do any cardio after or is that pretty much your cardio? Um, definitely I always have between 15 to 20 minutes cardio after workout. Is it running or because I've seen you run before, I've seen you walk, you do elliptical, stairs, just whatever you feel every, like? Every time is different. Okay. Whenever I feel it. I don't stick with the same one. What do you think the hardest part of all this stuff is? The high endurance and the balance. The balance and the endurance. Yeah, I would definitely think that everything is done on this, this ball. And I remember back when we used to train, you would actually add it. When we used to do shoulders and stuff, you would do the laterals and stuff on that, and you'd always add like a medicine ball or a Bosu ball or something like that. And you know, I wouldn't because <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a female and I try not to get that heavy. Yeah. So when I stand a ball, when I have the balance, they used to get harder. So this way, don't allow me to go heavy in the weights. Because you can actually train heavier. Yes, I've seen you train heavy. heavier. But what happens when you train heavier? You actually grow like. I grow so so quick. Which is that, that's genetic. I mean, that's just how it is. Now, did you know when you first started? training that you wanted to go in this type of training because not really anybody else is doing that stuff around here no but they keep coming in the centuries 24 centuries so new stuff keep coming balance stuff keep coming and i do like them you do like them. i mean some of the stuff you learn like online or whatever but some of it you make up uh, most of the stuff it's just my brain is working i know <laughs> the muscle how does it work i know the balance the core and just try variety do you have a name for it because i have a name for it you ready no Transka training. Yes, Sounds right. good, doesn't it? Yeah. Transka core. Transka core training. With K. With a K. <laughs> Thank you, Ani. We appreciate it. We'll see you soon. Enjoy. Bye.